Hello, my name is Aaron Schlesinger. I'm a category manager here in the Commercial Notebook Group uh, within HP. Um, I have two new Elite Book systems that I'm going to uh, present to you today. Uh, we're launching our Elite Book Folio 1040, which is our new um, Elite Book follow on to the 9470M product that we have today. Um, we really tried to get really ultra aggressive with weight and thinness with this notebook, so uh, as a true follow on for our premium flagship line. So, uh, at the first glance, uh, the system is 15.9 millimeters thin uh, at a weight of 3.3 pounds for, um, <coughs> excuse me, for a 14-inch uh, display uh, full enterprise notebook. We have, uh, to keep with the premium uh, line and, thought and thinking, right, we've designed the product in all machined aluminum, so both the, um, the back cover of the panel and the keyboard deck are all uh, machined aluminum, which gives you not only a good look and feel and uh, touch, but it also makes it extremely rugged. So we pass um, all of the mill standard 810G test, including the drop test, uh, which means that we drop it from a, a distance of 30 inches um, up to 24 times on multiple edges, corners, etc., and we guarantee that the system will still uh, boot. Um, along with uh, the premium thinking as well, we've uh, stepped up our game with resolution. So we have a standard uh, resolution of an HD plus or 16 by 9 uh, panel, and then um, our 1600 by 900 uh, panel resolution. We also have an option for a full HD 1080p panel, and then uh, we'll support both Windows 7 and Windows 8, so we'll have a touch option um, as well. So it's a uh, fairly comprehensive, uh, meets, meets all the requirements from the operating system standpoint. Um, Backlit keyboard is uh, standard, so no issues there for those delight features. We're also launching uh, the force pad within this system. So in the past, we've had the, the pick button um, touchpad implementation. We've had the click pad implementation. And this is now the force pad implementation. Um, the cool thing about it is that it's a solid surface pad and that it doesn't actually move. You, it actually senses pressure. So you get all the same functionality you've had in the past as far as mousing and right click and left click, et cetera. But there's some new um, gestures for like scrolling and uh, for like, let's say scrolling example. Um, the harder I push, the faster the, uh, the scroll will happen within like a web page. Or I can essentially move like an icon or a file by simply clicking on the icon and then moving it so there's not a double click or anything like that. So it's pretty cool technology. It's new with our partnership with uh, Synaptech and we're, it's exclusive to HP and this is the first product that we'll launch it on, on the 1040. A um, couple of the other things I wanted to note still staying true to commercial is that we still have a uh, smart card uh, reader uh, for, those, uh, for that level of security. We also still have the fingerprint reader as well for dual authentication, TPM included inside. Um, along with uh, standard ports, we actually continued our use of our side docking station. So this is the, the docking connector here. So we launched the new side docking station in, uh, with the 9470M. We're going to continue that same dock throughout all of our EliteBook 800 series and now the, um, the 1000 series as well. Um, one of the other things I wanted to note was we removed VGA and RJ45 from the system to get this thin, but we know that those ports are still important to commercial customers. So we've actually developed a, a pretty innovative dongle which actually gives you uh, VGA and RJ45 back, but it, puts, it allows, uh, the dongle actually plugs into the docking connector. And the cool thing about that is that there's no drivers to actually install on the system. It's all native via the docking connector. So you don't have to manage drivers if you deploy an image. You don't have to install drivers or anything like that. It's all actually right and straight and native. Um, we do, on the bottom as well, we, the system is actually serviceable. So the bottom cover will, can be removed, which lets you access the battery and all the other components inside in case something should go wrong or you'd like to upgrade, those types of things. So it's, it's not a completely sealed uh, design. So. But this is our new um, 1040, and uh, we're pretty excited about this one, so hopefully you'll take a look at it a little bit further. The other platform that I have is um, the Revolve 810 G2. So with this platform, um, you may have, it may look familiar. We launched the first generation of it last year. Uh, this is really a uh, refresh of the platform. So we've done a few enhancements. We've added 4G LTE. We've also enhanced the pin, so it's better precision writing, um, better palm rejection, et cetera. So um, the, the pin here, separate from the, separate from the system, but um, new, a new pin design. We've also upgraded the chipset to include uh, the latest Haswell technology from Intel. So it's got 
um, <clears throat> better performance and a little bit better battery life associated with it as well. So we're, we're pretty happy to have this one uh, back in our lineup with a refresh, a uh, little bit of a refresh. So, But these are the new Elite Books that will launch for um, HP Discover. So thanks for, thanks for listening.